Oh. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, I don't have anything on, well I have something on my face, I just don't have any concealer on, which you can tell, hopefully you can tell. If you can't, let me know and I will give up the concealer. Just kidding. Um, but today, I want to talk about two different concealers. Um, the difference between the Tarte Shape Tape, I got it around the first time. I used to do the Tarte Tape Shape, but it's actually Shape Tape, and the Tarte Maracuja Creaseless Concealer, which I've been wanting to try, and I'm running out of this, so I said, hey, let me give this a whirl and see the difference. And I thought you guys would kind of enjoy it. What's funny is that I've already gone out today looking like this, yes. Had my hair down. I put some Olaplex in my hair this morning and said, well, look, I need to put my conditioner on. I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I'm gonna go by Sephora <laughs> to get this and I'll come back. Yeah, I, I went out with my eyes looking tired, but it's okay. Gears. So let's start. I'm excited. Okay, so um, there is a difference definitely with the two. As you can see, just the the amount is more in the shape tape. The shape tape has 0 0.3381 fluid ounces, and the Miracuja, hopefully I'm saying that right is uh, 0.28 ounces. So, you know, 0.3 ounce difference, but this is also, this says it's full coverage, creaseless, and waterproof. Um, this is a full coverage. It doesn't talk about being, it's a contour concealer as well, but it doesn't talk about it being, you know, waterproof or anything of that nature. So, um, I normally get tan sand in the, shape tape and I decided to get tan in the Miracuja and they told me not to apply too much that a little goes a long way so I'm like okay but it doesn't come with a doe foot they want you to apply it with the brush I really don't like applying stuff with brushes so I'm gonna use my fingertips because that's just what I do and then blend it in with my beauty blender but this is interesting I like the packaging on this this is like wood right here um, and Miracuja just sounds pretty, sounds beautiful. So, hey, I'm ready to get into it. Let's go for it. I'm gonna put a couple dots right here. Okay, how about, oh, wow, okay. Just gonna, it's coming out a little watery to begin with, so. There we go. So it must be, must be an oil base. I'm assuming this ha this has oil in it because oil came right out. So let me kind of blend this in with my fingertips. Oh wow, yeah, this is definitely oil. <laughs> the consistency difference between the shape tape. This is definitely oilier. If I can, if I can say that. I have a few blemishes right there. Let's go ahead and do that too. I'll put some here at the top because I have, they say a little goes a long way. Man, they really mean that. Let me go ahead and blend this in or just let me let it sit for a second. I'm just going to, I let mine sit normally for a little bit. And let me set this one down. That came out a little bit oilier and probably the first time than I expected. My shape tape with the doe foot, which is easy application. This comes out a lot more matte. As you can see, I'm running out. So normally just one works. Okay. Set this down. All right, let's start blending this side and see. How this looks. Well. Huh. OK. 
Okay. I normally take my concealer all the way around my eye. Even though I don't actually put, um, I don't do my eyelids and stuff like that, um, I still take my concealer all the way around. <laughs> huh, okay. Okay, that's pretty. It's very, um, it is, it is coverage. Um, let me see if I build it up a little bit and add a little more. Use a little bit, dab a little bit more. Yeah, but this definitely is more of an oil base. You guys can. So. Let's see. Okay. Let's use the other side of the beauty blender and I'll take mine all the way down. Okay, now let's blend the shape tape side in. Put a little bit more tape shape on. Shape tape. This is how it looks without the powder. If I had to choose one, the shape tape would probably win, and that's only because it has the doe foot and it has a lot more broader color ranges. So they had tan for me. They didn't have they then they went to medium, whereas the shape tape has pure sand or um what is mine called it's not pure sand it's tan sand and then there's like a medium tan or for peach undertones and stuff like that so the shape tape has more variety but of course they're only sold at alta 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 and i think they're uh, sold on qvc too but sephora is is um just a walking distance away and i don't have to have it shipped so I wanted to try something different. And so, yeah, that's a, I like their Miracuja. It's nice. Um, but yeah, I would probably pick the Shape Tape. And so guys, tell me which one you like better. If you've tried them both or haven't tried either, you know, um, I recommend both. Um, but I do still like the Shape Tape. Yeah, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Yes, as I hold my beauty blender. Bye guys. <laughs> Hi guys. Okay, so this is a completely different day, but I did put that on the same outfit real quick. I know my hair is different and everything, so you can kind of tell that I'm different, but I had to get back on here and give an update. Normally I just, if a product for me changes, I put an update in the description. It says update, kind of like with the in, uh, the NYX uh, eyeliner, um, but I'm wearing the Miracusha today and it doesn't work well for me. I know in the video I said, oh, this is great, it's my first impression, and oh, it looked like it covered the same. It doesn't cover the same and it creases on me. So um, I've had this on for Maybe four hours heading on for 
max four hours, but probably more like three because I put it on right before we went to lunch and it's not even three o'clock yet. And I had it on at, put it on at 12.30 to get to lunch at one. So um, it is full coverage for probably people who don't have dark circles like me, which you guys have seen my dark circles and they just get worse when I'm tired or jet lagged, which is crazy. But yeah, I have some crazy dark circles. So I'm, I would probably use the Miracuja if you're not necessarily looking for a deep, intense, dark circle coverage. Whereas the Tarte Shape Tape, yes, that covers my dark circles and it looks amazing. And you know, when I'm having those really tired days, I can just pack that stuff on and it's just phenomenal. Miracuja for people who aren't looking for the full, full coverage that the Shape Tape gives. Um, and today, it didn't come out oily. It came out kind of like a clay, but it still was more oil consistency. Uh, you know, when I first did it, the oil just kind of splurred out on my face, but, or under my eye, but uh, yeah. So I want to give you my final thoughts on that. Um, it's already creasing up in here after a, a few hours. Um, and so it doesn't work necessarily for me. And it could be because I'm more of a mature woman. <laughs> Don't you love it when people say stuff like that? Like, you know, um, for a mature woman, and you always wonder, what are you about to say next? <laughs> or like it's an excuse for what I'm about to say, um, which basically I'm just using the word mature woman just because I have, you know, maybe crow's feet or some lines underneath my eyes, which at 20 I didn't have, but I also didn't have the experience that I have now. So, you know, give and take, that's how it works. Um, so yeah, it's creasing in my lines, but um, Outside of that, I did like the consistency um, because it was more kind of like blending into the skin and not sitting on it like the Shape Tape, but I personally need something more that sits on my skin to cover the dark circles. Or you know what, I could correct and then use the Miracuja, but the fact that I don't have to correct using the Shape Tape, it's just one less step for me. So yeah. Um, you guys choose which one you want. And if you're not looking for complete full coverage, then even though the Miracusha says it's full coverage, it's not as full as um, the Shape Tape. So yeah, if you're looking for more of a natural kind of cleaner palette, the Shape Tape, not the Shape Tape, the Miracusha would be better. <laughs> um, so yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an update on that. And I'll slide this in at the end of my video. And um, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.